What's up guys, back into there with another reaction to Attack on Titan, uh, a bit of a different format today, I'll be doing um, my usual uploads from now on rather than the live streams for the winter anime just because it's been lagging a bit recently so I don't want to really degrade in quality um, just so I can get there a bit faster so uh, with you today with uh, this kind of format but really excited for today's episode heard uh, well I think we're going to be uh, seeing Gabby and Falco's escape from uh, whatever prison they're in at Eldia, um on the Paradise Island, sorry, but uh, let me know what you guys think about this episode down in the comments. So leave a like on the video if you do like and subscribe to the channel if you do want to keep up to date with the reactions. Um, let's get right into it. Okay. <laughs> Excuse me, I just had my tea. <laughs> this is our plan, right? A brick. <clears throat> Oof. But damn. She ain't holding back with that brick. Oh, there's any turning back for her. <laughs> There's Rhino. They all captured, but they've just escaped. That was pretty ruthless scene with the brick. Yeah, really excited to see uh, Gabby and Falco's story after now escaping the jail. What the hell are they going to do? They're not even Titan shifters. They've got to do this as actual humans. I mean, it's hard enough doing it as a Titan shifter, especially in this age where they've got all this anti-Titan kind of weaponry. Yeah, Rhino, I don't think he's going to be happy that they got captured. Oh, I haven't heard the, um, I think the full version of this song got released this week. I need to listen to it. Like the OP version, I've just been listening to the extended version of it just on repeat, but I suppose we've got a full version now. Destruction. Oh, I think I did give it a listen the other day, actually, to be fair. But, um, I think it's actually a better version of, uh, better version of the opening. It sounds more like a song, I should say. It kind of sounds like, a, obviously, a declaration of war, which is very good because it had an episode about the declaration of war. Counterfeit. Yeah, I think they might have an inkling. Ask him. Yeah, it's still up in hands for her, isn't it? <laughs> he values that quite a lot. The honorary, uh, honorary armband, I think it is. So she fully intends to die. Oh, 
Oh crap. I guess they accepted. So Sasha's on edge. Sasha? Gabby. <laughs> My bad. I was going to say, she's not going to enjoy this. What is that? <laughs> Laos. Oh, my God. Wow. <laughs> There's no way. Out of every house, they end up at the blouse house. Jesus. I don't think, yeah, that, they don't even realise, do they? That this is Sasha's house, the, the girl that Gabby killed. To get them here. Get out of a helmet. Damn. Oh yeah, we're going to get a show, aren't we? <clears throat> I think, anyway. Flying boat. The Ice Burst Dome it was uh, only located here, wasn't it? Rumbling. Can't wait to see this. They've got a show to make. That's true. Ah. Uh, taxpayers. Piping up. Yep, brings up a good point.
the faded glasses. Wow. <laughs> She's going to prosecute them. Wow. Had some tough choices to, choices. Had some tough choices to make. Yeah, it's a never ending job what we saw from Erwin. How happy he was to end it all. She was in the crowd. She joined because Erin joined. I'm pretty sure. It's been a long time since I watched season one, I think, but <clears throat> brings up a point. She's doing the stance. Ah. Out of old memories. Ah. Wait. That Erin just killing. I'm gonna pause it for a sec because I'm not streaming. Again, as I just mentioned, it's been a long time since I watched season one. But I'm pretty sure that story went there a little bit like the people, the guys came in or something, and then Mikasa killed the guy. But right there, we just saw Erin with the knife, so. That kind of leads a bit to maybe how his uh, maybe how his emotions kind of laid from the start. But um, yeah, I'm pretty sure it went originally. Me Mikasa killed. Again, let me know in the comments. That's an interesting one. Um, three, one. The season involved a flock. Suspicious. Oh, pixies. <laughs> oh, charmer. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh. Kinda deserved. <laughs> oh dear. What a series of unfortunate events. That horse did look very scary. 
yeah. <laughs> Probably her tension combined with the horse didn't go well together. Very different mindsets towards Zeke there. <laughs> Really? <laughs> That's like a profit. She knows that from Marley. To say she's always looked a bit suspicious and not not very happy. Right. Oh shit. <laughs> Gotta fucking kill her. <laughs> oh, God damn. <laughs> Actually, helping her. Gabby's enraged, bro. Because they're nice people. Because <laughs> they're people. She had the chance to turn into a titan, that's what she done. How are you meant to account for that? <laughs> and they both make a good point, but... No. Mm. 
No reply. Yeah, they had no involvement. She understands. We're going to ask. There it is. It's a Sasha. Ah. Must be more like that older sister. <clears throat> I think she actually said there in Japanese. And I think that this gets subbed so fast, there's a bit few inconsistencies with the subs, but Yeah, I think that was Sasha. Interesting episode though. Again, another battle of uh, battle of ideologies and and most understandings of what's happened. Again, it, it, these people done something. There's no way you can hold people who have no relation to that act or behaving in that certain way. You can't ask for reparations. It's just for me, it's just so stupid. But yeah, it brings almost a lot of uh, current day kind of situations in uh, into question, which quite like it's a good episode but you definitely understand both Gabby and the uh, and the blonde lady's points we've got a preview for next week nobody They've understood. Four years ago. <laughs> oh. Good work, Magoth. A mopping up operation. Yeah. <clears throat> Bit of a dilemma we're in now. <clears throat> oh yeah. I'm oh, definitely not. Yeah, this is a tough scenario. They're going to go straight away. I was going to say, that's probably the only option we've got here. We've got to hit back now. And we've got to hit back now hard. But are they now going to presume that? The battle of, uh, battle of intelligence. How far ahead are they planning? Yep, your beliefs are shaken. Guides. 
So thanks for watching the video guys, really awesome episode there. Um, really, uh, really awesome talk with Gabby and Falco uh, with the blonde girl um, at the uh, at the Blouse Ranch, which is quite ironic, but um, yeah, really quite insightful talk there of, uh, to see how both both sides kind of see uh, the situation. And um, I think Gabby might have to hopefully understand a little bit better um, from where the blonde lady comes from about uh, these kind of like timelines and such of uh, people paying reparations for what other people done in the past and such. Um, some really interesting points, some really uh, interesting kind of flashbacks as well this episode, quite a lot of flashbacks and uh, I think there was like a change in the script almost of um, Erin and uh, the Mikasa situation which makes sense um, when you switch it around that Mikasa didn't kill uh, the guy early on in the series again, uh, this could just be my memory playing up but um, then it was actually Erin doing it which, uh, which definitely makes more sense considering his kind of anger and rage and such and his motivations early on the series but um that's a that's a heavy topic uh, let me know what you guys think down in the comments below there's a whole lot to unwrap this episode uh, leave a like if you do like and subscribe to the channel if you do want to keep up to date have a good rest of your day guys